Hey YouTube, what's good? It's your boy, the American African. Today is day 22 of this extended water fast. I'm feeling good today. It's just another day. I've been extremely tired lately though, because I've been working a lot, but I'm making a lot of progress on that, on the stuff, on the projects I'm working on. So I'm not complaining, you know? Um, I don't even feel like I'm really fasting, you know? Every day I wake up and I'm like full. Even right now, I feel actually full. You know, that's when I know I've reached that certain point in my fast that my body is fully utilizing my energy efficiently because my energy loads are not fluctuating. You know, I'm pretty much doing the same sort of activities every day. Just sitting my ass at home and laying down and trying to sleep. You know, I'm not moving too much. Every now and then I go like shopping or something. That's a very small movement, you know. So... Yeah, I'm in, I'm in my zone. I'm in my flow. And I'm just going to keep flowing. I don't know how long I'm going for. I have not got on the scale. You know, the funniest thing is that if I do go on vacation next week and I have not got on the scale, I'm not going to weigh myself on my vacation. So technically, I won't know how much I weigh. But at this point, I could pretty much look in the mirror, put on certain clothes, and I know my weight range. You know, for all the numbers people's out there. But, you know, I'm, I'm kind of, I won't say that the numbers don't help. I mean, getting on the scale helps so much because there's times when I'm in denial, you know. <laughs> but the numbers never lie. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They could fluctuate or look very good for a day or two, you know, at times. But numbers don't lie. You know what I'm saying? But um, the scale just isn't important to me right now since I'm getting steady, steady weight loss. If I do eat before I go on vacation, the numbers will matter because I definitely want to know how much I weigh after going on vacation, depending on what I eat. Um, you know, I've been taking a B complex. I've been taking zinc. That's pretty much the two pills I take. Every now and then I do take magnesium, potassium pills, but for the most part, I get it from my snake juice. This is one of the first fasts I've done, 21 days, where I haven't needed snake juice. I haven't really needed it. I Well, I've, have, I've had my times where I really needed it, but other than that, I haven't needed it. You know what I'm saying? My, my blood pressure has been pretty steady. I haven't reached uh, orthostatic hypotension, low blood pressure. I have not reached that. Yeah. So... Only bad news about that is if I haven't reached that, that means my weight is still high. Because I noticed that once my weight gets to a certain point, I get hypotension when I water fast very easily. And I have to snake juice supplement, you know. But either way, the, the, the number's coming down. Another reason why I decided to extend my water fast, if I'm to be completely honest, is that I don't like how I look, you know. Like, I'm too big, and I don't like how I feel. I, feel. I just feel so heavy, you know what I'm saying? And being that around this time last year, I was so light, and I was able to do so much. I was out there just moving, moving, moving. Right now, I mean, I was moving in the beginning of the year when I was big, but it was different, you know? <laughs> now it's like, okay, the numbers are coming down. If they come down more, I can do more faster. And I will like the way I look and everything. I'll just be able to enjoy life more. So let me just take the numbers down. If I'm going to be completely honest with you, you know, it's weird because a part of me kind of feels like people should not. Let me just speak for myself. Water fasting to lose weight is kind of temporary. So I know that if I develop just normal exercise habits, normal healthy eating habits, the, the weight will drop eventually, and it's more sustainable. But I feel at the same time that I'm so big right now, I'm so heavy right now, that I'd rather just get the weight off and then try and maintain it from there. <sighs> Everyone has their opinions, you know? But at the end of the day, just as I used to say last year, I'm just going with the flow. And this is the flow right now. Right now, I feel like water fasting, so I'm I'm riding the wave, you know, because 
at some point I'm gonna get tired of water fasting and my only option will be diet and exercise so I'm enjoying the water fasting right now it's day 22 and um, I mean I'm just steady riding this wave you know I give all glory to God for giving me the strength I remember <laughs> The whole month of January trying to start a water fast. I mean, literally the whole month of January. And then it, it took three weeks. I did my first 21-day water fast. Bang. Now I'm on my second. Bang. There might be a third. Bang. But for now, one day at a time, this is where I'm at. And we're going to keep pushing, you know? It's your boy, the American African. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.